Well, speaking of songwriting, how much of your songwriting is uh, from the heart and how much is from the head? I use a song like uh, Shakespeare as an example. Those lyrics are the perfect balance of the realist and the romantic. So. Yeah. Well, Shakespeare is, some, is a song I've been trying to write for, for years, just based on this concept that when I was taught Shakespeare at school, um, I was just too young to understand any of the concepts. So why do they bother teaching you Shakespeare when you're at school? Like Romeo and Juliet, the only thing you can compare that to when you're 15 is the fact that you fancy Diana Green, who sits over there, who's really cute. That's all you've got. You don't know about love, suicide, death, tragedy, all the family beefs, you know, the whole... It's so annoying. And I remember when I got my heart, like, broken for the first time, big time, you know, I was like, I don't know how old I was when that happened. Like, 17 or something. Then all of a sudden, I got tragedy. So I'd had some tragedy, a tiny little tragedy. Anna didn't want to go out with me anymore. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> all of a sudden I understood this, this tragedy thing. And that was like two years after we studied Romeo and Juliet at school. So I've been meaning to talk about that for ages, but I just couldn't get into it. And then um, I got asked to write a song for a film in, in America when I was living in, in LA for a while. Um, and they wanted a song about um, roughly like this, this issue when you're young, you don't really know what's going on and then you get a bit older and it all makes sense. And I'm like, the kid, I'm gonna do this Romeo, Juliet, school thing. And I, so I wrote most of the song for this movie and then they didn't use it. And I was like, great. Cause it was really, cause it was a really good song. And I was like, after I finished Shakespeare, I delivered it to the movie company. And, and I was kind of like, oh, actually, this is really good, this one. I wish, I wanna, I wanna keep it to think. But if they take it, yeah, fair enough. And they actually said, oh, it's not quite what we're after. I was like, yes, sweet. <laughs> um, luckily, they took another one. But yeah, yeah, the, um, it's all from the heart and the head just helps order it. But it's all heart overhead. It's got to be passion over skill and, and all that because, um, you know, too much skill, you just lose all the, all, the, all the intensity if you're just being too skillful. Like, um, like say, you know, I don't know, like Rihanna can sing a terrible song and make it sound great. Because it's all this, it's such an intense delivery of a few lyrics. Whereas like someone like some of these more pop singers, they're all skill and no passion, so they can sing like anything all over the place, but it doesn't mean anything. And I think that, especially if you're a guy, singer, songwriter, it's got to all be, in, it's got to be all intensity and, 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 and passion, and you can't think too hard. Artists, you don't really have the mental capacity to think if you're an artist, it's just too overwhelming to think about it. You just have to just do it. So, yeah, it's all from the all from the heart. No lies either, because then you don't. Because if you if you if you're honest all the time, then you never need to worry about which lies you've told. <laughs> you know. True words. You know when you're at school and you're a teenager and you kind of tell loads of little lies or whatever, and then when you go to university, it's your first opportunity to go right. From now on, I'm going to just be honest. Do you know what I mean? Mm. That had definitely happened to me. By the time I hit 18, there were so many random little lies that I'd told that I was, as soon as I got to university, I was like, great. I'm just going to be me now. See if that works. <laughs> and, it, and it actually did. I was really, really surprised that being yourself actually works, you know? Yeah. It just takes yeah. ages to learn that. Yeah. I wish I knew that at 15. Yeah, no, maybe it wouldn't have been such much such fun then. Yeah, true, true. Yeah, yeah. To find out where. Yeah.